Hey guys, it is me, Ender Unicorn here, and today I'm back with another video. Now, you don't see my hot bar because, um, I am actually have the GOI off. I was doing that for the intro. So. Now, the cool thing is you can use cellular, cellular data. But today I'm going to be introducing my hotel. I built this in creative, obviously. But I use it in survival. So if you guys speak Spanish, you know that this means the Hotel of the Minecraft. It was supposed to be of the Ender Dragon, but I chose Minecraft instead. But you walk in, you're greeted by this big fountain. And then you got another one right here. And then you come over here, you know, you can just chill. This is the guest book, you know, where you're supposed to pretend and sign. Um... And this is the front desk with all the keys, you know, there's up to, I think, like 10 rooms. And then there's the diamond and emerald suite. And those are for employees only. So. Um, room one and two. I decorated room one. Because sometimes I use this for role play, so, yeah. Um... Pretend all well, the moms we've killed here that like walked in and yeah. Employees of the month Steve, Jim, Bob, Luke, Ryan, Tiffy Quake, which is I has Cupquake, and her husband Red. So January, February, March, April, May, June, and July. And rooms three and four. And then coffee maker, this is house blend. Coffee beans. Um and then coffee cups, our flat screen TV, the dining place, because um, at the hotel that I would stay in, there was this little dining place, and then it had a room to the, um, doors to the courtyard, but I'm not doing that. And then in there, there'd be a TV, and you could sit, eat breakfast, which they would have out from 6 to 11, and watch TV. So that's the front desk. And then we go upstairs, and there's a little table, and then there's more rooms, and there's a dog there. And then you go to the top, where the diamond and emerald suites are. There's another fountain, you're not supposed to swim or drink from the fountains. And then there's this ginormous grill that I've seen on YouTube. I was watching someone do um, a survival video. And these two are supposed to put coal in it. And then this is the uncooked stuff that you want to put in there, you know, like iron and stuff like that. And then when it's cooked, it's supposed to go into this chest. And yeah. But that's, the, that's this world. Um, and soon I'll actually be expanding. And some of the rooms actually look different because they're designed different. Like this one, it didn't have any of this. It only had these, and then one bed, with, and this wasn't there either, and neither was this bed. The window was there, though, and that was there. But that's because you can then go into your room, shut the door, and then get your key, or you can come out um, sh and get the key, you know, like, stand right here, grab the key, the door will close, and you can get out, and you can just put your key back in when you want to go in. Then this one says it's on the corner. It's designed like this. It has two windows. It has a bed here. And then crafting table, furnace, and then a chest. And it's basically the same on the other side. And then I'll show you the rooms up here. So. And then I'll show you the diamond and emerald suite. The emerald suite is where two of our employees stay. So I actually need the levers, the keys for these rooms. So let me go downstairs and get the keys. Now the diamond room, I don't know where the key went, so um, I have to use the Emerald Suite key. So five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So. And I think I did the upstairs wrong because um, I think there's two sevens when there's supposed to be like a 10 or something. But let's start over here on five. So this is room four key, it's for downstairs. So room five key, um, 
two furnaces here, crafting tables on top, space, and then chest because you can't open a chest if there's something that is not um, clear, you know, like glowstone or glass or something like that. And the bed is here, and then you have the rest of the room to decorate. Like, you can decorate all these rooms as you want. You know, as much as you want. So this is the room six key. So room six doesn't really look any different. It's basically the same. And then room seven is different because it's on top of these. So this is one of the biggest rooms in the entire hotel. You know, you got your furnaces on bottom and then your crafting table and then next to it is your chest. Um, you have all of these are bay windows. You know, you can just get in there, you know. So the bed is on the bay window. Let me sleep, actually. I'm sleeping in this person's bed. <sighs> okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. You're going to have to do that a couple times, actually. So I might actually have to move that. So I actually do think there's another seven. I should actually change that. But I'm actually going to be expanding this world, you know, putting like plaza and stuff like that in there. So, wait, what? 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 Oh, the names. The names go away once you break the lever. But these are bay windows and there's this. It was originally a fountain, but that took up too much space. Let's see, there's another room, seven. And it's exactly the same as the other one, just on the other side. So. This is room 8. And you can use any key on these. I just like to designate a key. And these aren't actually different from the ones over there. So. That's why the diamond sweet key look said lever. Because I broke it a lot. And then this is room 9. It's not really different from the other room. You know, it just looks like that. And then we go upstairs and I'll just use one of these levers on the diamond suite. So I actually was in here and then I moved all this stuff that was in here, except for these three maps, over to the emerald suite, you know, for the other employee that works here. But this is the diamond suite. These are for employees only. And then this is the emerald suite, which the lever is already on. But this is my kitten. I'm going to name her um, Afmau, or if I can um, see what Afmau's cat's name is, um, Afmau's cat name. And then this is the my side. You know, I have my little ladder here, so I can go up to my bed and sleep. And then this is my chest, my table, my map, my flower on top of my crafting table, my furnace, and then this is the other employee's side, and they have two beds for some reason. I don't know why I did that. But, yeah, that's this world here. Let me show you room three and four, actually. They're not really any different, but this is what um, room one would look like if it wasn't decorated. So... Now you have your window here, and then you have your one bed and your chest, furnaces, and crafting table. And then we got a room four, which again doesn't really look any different than um, room two. So I'm gonna actually go put these levers on the doors. So it doesn't really matter what lever I use, because none of them have names anymore. have to change that one and so yeah guys um that was a tour of the hotel i hope you guys enjoyed if you did leave a like and comment your favorite por part or what i should actually do to the hotel to make it an improvement and um if you guys have any ideas on, like, what I should build, because I'm kind of going for a modern slash medieval, you know, medieval look, but 
actually modern? Um, let me know so I can add that in. And if it's, if you can, something that's not too hard, but if it is hard, I'll just like um, look stuff up online and, you know, use those kinds of designs. So, yeah. But if you guys liked it, um, like and comment. If you didn't like it, then either don't do anything or dislike the video. I don't really care. But, um, yeah. If you guys, um, ever find me, you know, be able to, so you can play with me, you know. My name is Swagboy22 with four twos because I have to use my cousin's Microsoft account and that is his name. So, yeah, I actually can't see where anything is. Really, I can't. Like, I am just guessing where things are. But, um, yeah, if you guys want to play, you can come and then you have to pay for decorations. Like, I'll go into creative, you know, get you some, the decorations you want and you have to pay gold ingot. Yes. And for the diamond and emerald suite, if you are going to stay in the diamond suite, um, if I don't find enough employees, then you have to pay for with a diamond or an emerald, but usually you just have to pay with an iron for your room. An iron a week. Minecraft week, that is. But, if you guys ever want to play with me, you can decorate your room as you want, you know. You can move things around, you can actually take things out if you don't like anything that's in there, you know. You think two furnaces or two crafting tables is too much or not enough. You guys can take anything out, add anything you want, as long as when you're done playing and you don't want that room to be there anymore, just fix it to its original um, pattern. So if anybody else wants to move in, they can, and they can decorate it as they want. But those are my rules, and yeah. So I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. And do Unicorn, out. Bye, guys.